third lap is just the death of me. Oh, don't flip it, don't. Ah, no! Okay, oh, oh brakes! How's it going, guys? Dre here, and welcome back to another episode of Wreckfest. Today, we're going to be checking out a new update that has come out that has released two new maps, one that is majorly over the top and another one that's quite realistic and nice. Uh, they've also released a new DLC car pack, which I have indeed bought and downloaded. And I gotta say, some of these cars are even more over the top than other cars in this game. And that's saying something, considering we have sofa cars, lawnmowers, double-decker cars. Well, this has added a bunch of more fun stuff to uh, play around with. Starting off with, we have the War Digger. Obviously a military inspired pickup truck. We got a lot of fun stuff on the top like an RPG. The question is does that thing explode? I hope so, but I doubt it. Uh, I gotta say this is probably a great vehicle though for a destruction derby. I mean look at it. It's got a roll cage in the front for the freaking engine. So yes, that's probably the most legit one. The, ne the rest of them are kind of over the top and I love that about this game now. I thought this game was gonna go the realistic route, but I kind of like that they went the arcade over the top route. Uh, starting off with, well, se well, the second one is we have the pocket rocket and uh, yeah, this was probably absolutely horrifying to drive in a destruction derby because, well, it's really small and a simple tap's probably going to absolutely destroy you. But what is that engine? Is that like a, a weed whacker engine on the front? Jesus. So yeah, we're gonna be testing out all these cars today. Uh, the next one, something that I've wanted for a while is kind of like a monster truck-like vehicle. It's not crazy big, but it's definitely got the biggest tires in the game so far. And it's a Volkswagen Bug, which makes it even better because that's rear engine, as you can see. So you can crash the front up as much as you want, and you're really not going to destroy the car too much. Also, what the hell is up with the studs? God damn. It's the most punk rock Volkswagen Bug I have ever seen. Moving on, we have the Drag Slayer. Uh, this thing is just so over the top in so many different ways, but it looks fantastic. I must say that and uh, I have a sneaky suspicion This one's going to be quite fast. Actually the top speed is only 7.7. .7. You would think it'd be way higher, but uh, yeah Finally we have the killer pig now this one doesn't make any sense at all But that's what I love about it kind of takes me back to like twisted metal or something like that I feel like it should be in that game But yes, basically it's a vehicle that's turned into a giant punk rock pig and uh, Yeah, that one's going to be really fun to drive. So let's take these things out We're gonna do some simple races today now before that I'm gonna upgrade all these to the max that I can upgrade them to uh, We have the race locked uh, requires level 9 unfortunately. I'm too much of a noob to unlock everything so far uh, but yeah, you can actually customize your cars quite a bit now as you can see and obviously we want these things to be as competitive as possible All right, so the first track we're gonna do is the realistic one the non over-the-top one It's called Vales Fall Circuit and it looks quite good It's a good off-road and on-road track from what I've seen so far and we're gonna try the main circuit out uh, Should we do the killer pig? I feel like with a, with a legit track we should actually get a legit vehicle So let's try the drag slayer out here that's an A-class car. We're going to do Bang a Race with the maximum amount of people, which is 23. AI vehicles can be Class A as well, and uh, Damage Normal sounds good to me. Uh, let's get into this, and uh, yeah, hopefully it goes well. All right, welcome to the beautiful Veil vale Falls. Okay, that was a quick introduction. Well, I guess it doesn't show the whole course. All right, well, start it up, and uh, hopefully we know what we're doing here. Now, I foresee that this vehicle is going to be very fast. But it's probably not going to take damage too well, so I'm going to try and play this quite passively. I can tell already I clearly have the speed advantage here because I just flew through the competition. I'm going to try my best to not stay into the damage areas here and just play passively. Let these guys fight each other out. We just had a, a tidal wave of cars go over that side. I don't know if you saw that. Okay, I'm getting scrunched in the back now. We're going to have to pick this up, get ahead of the competition because I'm just going to get banged to hell if I stay back there too long. So yeah, it's a nice mixture of off-road and a little bit of on-road. All right, fifth place. If we can get a podium finish, I'll be happy. That was the best lap. So it's not a very big track. Already we're on lap three. Oh, I took that way too hard. Damn it. Uh, I don't know if this is really my type of vehicle. I'm more of a, a defensive type vehicle. Heavy armor and a little bit slower so I can crash into people. This one, I feel like you have to play like a dainty little speedy boy and uh, not get hit at all. Definitely not my type of uh, racing, but I mean, we're doing all right. I'm spinning the wheels like crazy. It wants to go fast. This really isn't the course for this though. We don't really have too many straights or anything like that. 
Final lap. Man, if I can get a third, I'll be so happy. Come on. Okay. Slow and steady. I don't want to spin out like last time. Uh, no, I'm not, I'm not risking it. I don't know if it's going to spin out or not. Get out of my way! I got to get third. I just got to... Oh, brakes, brakes. Oh, I got, I got too cocky. I got too cocky. Damn it! Fourth place. Oh, come on. Come on. There's the finish line right there. And unfortunately, if I would have took that turn a lot better, I would have got my third place that I wanted. Uh, but we got fourth with the, uh, with the speedy boy. As you can see, though, best lap, 37 seconds, a hell of a lot better than the competition. Actually, we had 38 down way at the bottom here. It's kind of weird how some of the best laps are at the at the bottom. Actually, did I see a 36? No, I think I saw that 39 and thought it was a 36 or the 46. So, yeah, we had some pretty fast laps, 38 way at the bottom here, too. Uh, but not enough to win. Came in fourth. Let's try the other map, though. That one was pretty fun if you like a realistic race, but... That's not what I'm here about. I'm, I'm, I'm here for the over-the-top maps. So, yeah, if we go back here, there it is right there. Hell Ride. And, yes, it, it does look like something that I shouldn't mention. But, uh, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna go around it and have a fun time. Yep, that's all I'm gonna say about that. Uh, Bugzilla for sure. That's, that's what we had to start with. So, we're gonna click that. Uh, that was an A-class. I'm thinking... We can do special mix as well. Those ones are always fun. Motorhome might be fun as well. Yeah, you know what? Let's do special mix. That has a lot of the over-the-top vehicles that are absolutely dumb. All right. Let's get back into it and see what this race course is all about. All right, and welcome to Hell Ride. Oh, God. It looks so good already. So this, I know it has lots of bank turns and whatnot, and it's extremely dangerous. So we're just going to get right into it and start it. We got a lawnmower right beside me. Good luck, buddy. Oh, wow. First person camera's on this one. Not too hot. Oh, somebody hit me in the back already. Okay, there we go. That's a good view right there. Wow. Didn't expect this thing to be so speedy. But yes, this is probably the craziest course I've seen ever. So you have options with this one. Oh, we're going for a little spinny ride. Okay, well, we got lots of time to catch up. But look at this. You can choose to go left or right. I was going to go to the right, but I realized I was way too late. And yeah, basically, this is a death course, to say the least. And we are in the Bugzilla right now, which is great for this. I should have ran over that lawnmower guy. Oh, God. You guys are way behind. Harvester, get out of the way. Oh, damn it. We just made the freaking transport truck do a barrel roll. Now, you can go to the bottom as well. I guess we're going to the bottom. Obviously, the top's a lot more fun, though, because you're doing crazy jumps. I'm still in first. Okay. There's the motorhome that's just passing me. Yeah, looks like everybody's just totally getting destroyed here. That limo's looking like it's on its last legs already. And here we go around the balls. Um, that's what I'm going to call it anyways, the ball turn. Look at that bank. Look at how you can just constantly get speed here. And as long as you avoid the crazy competition, you should be good. Oh, speaking of competition. Oh, my God. Okay. Maybe, maybe slow down a little bit. That was a little fast. Okay, my best lap. Yay. That was my only lap, but I'll, I'll, I'll take it. Well, I think the goal of this course is to just not die. Speaking of death, there we go. <laughs> I'm just going to take out all my competition. We got a guy going around the balls here. Let me see if I can hit him on the way out. Oh, that's a harvester. I, You know what? I think that's the only thing that's probably going to survive this is the old harvesters because uh, that's just a lot of vehicle to take down, and it seems to have a lot of HP. All right, full speed. My dream is to hit somebody midair. On this jump here. Okay, not I didn't want to hit myself though. Damn it, I am legit stuck. Okay. Oh, sorry, sofa dude. Oh, there you go. Oh, you wrecked me? You bastard. Okay, I thought I would be okay with the Bugzilla, but clearly not. Alright, let's try a different vehicle. Alright, doing a nice simple class C race. <laughs> I feel like I shouldn't be in class C. I should be in preschool or something. What this is like a power wheel, seriously. I, I'm not going to even be able to keep up. I'm actually surprised I can go 100 kilometers with this thing. Okay, well, this is going to be hard to survive the whole race. That's for damn sure. But I am a small target, so I guess that's the one benefit. It's going to be hard to hit me. Oh, God. Oh, please please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Okay, best lap? Hell yeah, dude. Oh, my God. There's just, there's just cars flying everywhere. This is such a good map. If you just like over-the-top crash courses... This is perfect. There's, there's crashing on literally every turn. Oh, no. Oh, damn it. There's my first hit. Thankfully, it didn't really take me out. I'm just leaning a bit to the uh, right now. Oh, God. Okay. 
Oh my god. Ah! Jesus, my head! I oh, oh my god! Are you serious? Are you si Can I not DNF? Okay, that, that, that was a bad choice of car, but I did want to crash into a vehicle mid-jump. Didn't want to be in the world's smallest car while doing it, though. I wanted to take out someone else, not somebody take me out. All right, well, let's let's go back and try a different vehicle. How about that? All right, it's the piggy's turn. Gotta be honest, this is probably the last car you'd think would win this, because it's not aerodynamic at all, but, uh, hey, don't hit my butt. Stop hitting my butt. I'm not very fast, man. Got these damn ears slowing me down due to the aerodynamics. Oh, actually, it's Maul. Sorry, Maui in front of me going so damn slow. This thing is really not fast at all, though. If, if we win with this one, that's just sad. All right, get out of here with your old ass car. Pit time! That's right. I'm a very aggressive pig, damn it. A good old 50 XP slam. Yes, please. How, how's my vehicle looking? We got a little bit of red damage in the front, but not too bad. This thing might be more reinforced than the other ones. Uh, not, looks like they're getting off. Most of them, looks like I got a perfect shot to get on here. Oh, get out of my way! Head on crash. Okay, now I'm a really damaged piggy. Uh, excuse me, sir. Excuse me, I have places to be. All right, we got lots of dead cars around as you can see already. Only on the second lap. Oh my God, I almost lost piggy's head. Oh, dude, this is such a good course for just total destruction. Oh God, oh Jesus Christ. Okay, I was playing with the cameras. That was like the perfect timing. That was actually a really cool camera. As you can see, Piggy's front, it's not more, not very Piggy-like anymore. Critical damage already. All right, I'm at the last 10%. There's literally a fire in my asshole right now. Great. All right, I might be a second from death, but I ain't no bitch. I'm going down the middle here. Final lap, here we go. Please don't destroy me on the jumps. That would really, really suck. Okay, we're okay. Oh no, are you, damn it. I saw him at the last second. Ah, can I please just finish one race here? Damn it, how was my best lap at least? Way better than the competition. So, statistically, I should win these things, but I can't keep my car together long enough. All right, well, we got one car left to try. We're doing a Class B race, and this is my kind of vehicle. Like I said, I like defensive vehicles, and I feel like that's exactly what this thing is made for. We got a roll cage around our freaking engine. We are not a speedy boy, as you can tell. Uh, okay, maybe it was that guy in front of me again. Again, I, I can't really see in front of me very well, but uh, we might be faster than it seems. Oh, great. Great start. Great freaking start. I am already apps. I just lost half my health. Great! Freaking great! I'm gonna try my best with this vehicle. I can't believe I just had such a bad crash right at the start. Talk about unlucky. Get out of my way! That's right. <laughs> I just got a bunch of XP at least. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Yep, there we go. A little bit of engine damage never hurt anybody except me every time I freaking DNF in this stupid course. All right, we're okay. We're still in second. This is first place right here, clearly. Oh, no. What am I doing? Oh, no, 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 no. Please, God. Okay, I'm, o I'm only on lap two. Oh, my. Really? The best, the most offensive car didn't even last two laps. Jesus. All right, well, we tried Bugzilla with the wacky cars, and, uh, well, it did pretty well. Now we're actually in an A-class race, which is what the Bugzilla is. So, I feel like this is the answer. Volkswagen Bugs have the benefit of having a rear engine, so as long as we don't flip on the ramp like an idiot like before, we should be okay. Oh my god, I'm just pushing people out of my way. This feels amazing. It's a little bouncy due to the tires, as you can clearly tell. Oh, 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 just don't hurt yourself too much. Just don't hurt yourself, little guy. Okay, re reset, reset, reset. And there you go. A little love tap for you. A little love tap for you. And I'm flipping my... Oh, my God. That was not worth it. That was... Stop hitting me! It's almost like the point of this race is to hit me. Get... Oh, okay. I'm just hitting everybody at this point. I'm just going to reset and pretend that didn't happen. We're down to less than half health because I just hit every freaking vehicle. Did they make this game harder or is this the most destructive course we've ever seen? Because I really never have had an issue DNFing in this game. Like, never. Even with the new Carnival one, it's absolutely crazy. Oh my god, okay, that, that was that was all me. That was all me as well. Damn it! Just let me drive straight! Now we just gotta uh, uh, not, not, not die. Okay, we killed someone, so that was worth it. But now I'm down to stop going! What the frig? Oh my god, how do I die so much here? What happened to that guy? He's so squished. Oh, that was great. 
Okay, I don't want to jinx it, but I am in first place. Just had my best lap, as you can see, and I had a really smooth lap there. I almost hit somebody. Oh my god, are you serious? Okay, well, he took a lot more damage than me, at least, but... Oh god, now, now we're back at deja vu moment, where I'm gonna freaking die, because I'm down to 16 health. Oh, man, I literally can't hit any anybody again. It's This is like every freaking time I, I race here. Third lap is just the death of me. Oh, don't flip it. Don't. Ah, no. Okay. Oh, oh brakes. Ah, oh, God damn it. Are you serious? Well, maybe speed's the answer. This, I realize this vehicle never got to try here. So every other vehicle's not working. Why not try this one? And if we can get ahead of the competition, well, it's not really going to help too much because we obviously go head on with the competition all the time. But if we can just get out of the pack. I feel like we'll do so much better. Oh my god. And I'm not being no wimp. We're going down the middle again. <gasps> okay. Oh, what am I doing? That's not even a good jump. Oh! Did I wreck? Okay, no. I wrecked him. I was like, did you? Did I just wreck? No, okay. We still have 50. We're okay. We're on the final lap, guys. I don't want to get excited yet. But I think this was the answer. And I got to say, this thing's great at racing. Now, this is probably my favorite vehicle now. Just because I can actually do laps with it without dying, basically. Oh, God. Uh, uh, okay, I jumped over someone. Okay, I'm so nervous right now. Don't hit me. Okay, I'm going this way. You guys go that way. Yes! Yes! I might make it! Wrecking assist. Yes, please. Oh, I see it! I see it! I did it! Oh, my God. That... How many races did that take? Like, seven? Just, just to get one finish. All right, let's see how we did, too. Uh, best lap was 51 seconds. By far the best vehicle on the course, as you can see. Uh, not even, no one even got close to me. Looks like the closest was like 59, 57, actually. All right, guys, and that's going to wrap it up for this episode of Wreckfest. I hope you guys enjoyed checking out the new vehicles on the DLC pack, as well as the new maps that have been updated in this game, which are totally free, by the way. You don't need the DLC map. Or sorry, you don't need the, the DLC pack for the maps. That's just for the new vehicles. So yeah, uh, absolutely amazing course, as you can clearly tell. Uh, another over-the-top one and another realistic one. I like that they're doing a little of both. They're not just going all over the top. Because uh, not everybody likes that, but I definitely do enjoy some of the over-the-top ones. Uh, and yeah, they're both great courses. And the new map pack, or sorry, the new vehicle pack. I mean, obviously amazing vehicles. I really wish they had a little more uh, defense, but uh, clearly that was just due to me driving like a crazed maniac. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Wreckfest. If you guys do want to see more, let me know in the comments below. Uh, a lot of you guys seem to be enjoying this game, which is nice. But yeah, we're going to wrap it up here. Thanks for watching and liking, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.